amazing what's been done because it was so daunting for so many players and coaches when the protocols came out as the pass is caught by Fuller and he takes first down for the Texans from their own 16 yard line trying to get back into the game and a good pass over the middle and that's hauled in there from the 48 Downfield goes Watson, and this time it is Fuller able to make the catch. Got position. 33 to 16 loss to Baltimore. Shotgun. Watson has the time. A laser beam over the middle, and he connects with Will Fuller from the 14. Watson lofts it. Touchdown! Will Fuller scintillating from Watson. First half. Well, it was a quick throw. But it was to the outer portion of the field. Perfectly thrown ball. But watch out Will Fuller. Remember we saw Eric Ebron uncover by being physical? This time Will Fuller uncovers late in the route by going over the top of Steven Nelson. But that ball is so well thrown. And Smith in that secondary. Do they try and take advantage? Pass is caught. Touchdown, Texans! Will Fuller! Empty for Watson. He's got time. He's going deep. Catch made. Will Fuller. Exactly what you want to see. You call a play that's a potential shot play. You really basic with coverages. They're in man-to-man -man coverage right now. Watson fires and it's caught. And then up on his feet and it is Will Fuller for a touchdown. Nobody touched him. A 19-yard score. And Houston increases its lead. Yeah, I think we're having a little bit of fun now. I mentioned the man-to-man -man coverage. You see the gap between Will Fuller and his man, and once Herndon runs by him, he slides down, he gets up. I think the Astros are still in the playoffs, so it'd be a nice slide at second base. They are. They play Tampa Bay. Watson, little pass over the middle. That is complete. The first down yardage. This is Will Fuller. Fuller still on his feet and out of bounds just across the 40-yard line. 8.45 to play here in the fourth quarter. Watson going to go deep. All the way down to the end zone. It is caught for the touchdown. Will Fuller. With a guy like Will Fuller, you can't allow him to get behind you in the secondary. Only two receptions for Fuller. Third and goal from the six. Watson throws. This time the catch is made for Fuller, and he crosses the plane for a Texans touchdown. <laughs> no question, Adam. You're right. All right, Chiefs territory. Oh, he's adding a nice, uh, interesting wrinkle. Fuller on the catch, and he breaks free. Will Fuller will score. Went on and on about how Romeo was uh, right across the hall, and they were all hours. Here's Fuller. Still not touched to the 40. It was a knee injury, but able to go. Second and five and wide open. Fuller trying to cut away. Sean to do. First and 15. Lost this one for Fuller. He's open. Touchdown, Houston. <laughs> I mean, he literally just ran by him on this play. Touch on the bottom. If this safety's here, who else are you helping over here? There's nobody. <laughs> I just scribbled over there. It's like, go help on the fastest guy in the field. You're just too far away. Watson sees that. And he just throws a perfect ball. But Fuller's so fast. It's hard for me to think you're not going to get over there. Lions, Tigers, Red Wings, and Pistons games all play within a few city blocks. Look at Duke Johnson. Tosses it back. And wide open is Fuller for the touchdown. Are you kidding? I mean, this is unbelievable. Just silencing the fans here, but this is outstanding play calling. You know how many plays are run like this right now out in the backyards of America on Thanksgiving Day? You know, this shouldn't work. They're going to blitz here, okay? So you're going to hand it here. Then he's going to run over here, throw it back to Watson. And all the while, he's just standing out here like no one cares. And there's no one within 20 yards. Well, I mean, you don't. That's not an